Everyone, it's Ross, and I want to do a quick video on my Chi or my Che. This is a, a female variety of Che called Norris, and uh, there's been many female varieties out there, supposedly, that have fruited without a male present. And the male uh, usually is what is required for these Che trees to, uh, to fruit and to pollinate themselves so that uh, it'll actually ripen instead of dropping off the tree. Uh, before it's ready and it seems like a lot of people have trouble with these um, a lot of people swear that they need to reach full maturity uh, some people swear that you just need a male but the male in the end actually makes the fruit really not that pleasant to eat it becomes very seedy um, so I want the full experience you know I want to do this with a female um, but I am growing it in a container in a 10 gallon size pot and it's got a really nice shape to the tree you know, it's really doing well. Uh, it's growing very well. There's absolutely no signs of any kind of leaf problems, of any deficiency. Um, and I think that a lot of that has to do with the container and just the practices that I use in, in growing many of my trees in containers. Uh, they seem to do quite well. And I'm hoping that uh, because it's in a container, it can maybe fruit easier than it would in the ground, as most people have, have trouble doing. So that's the goal, and um, you can see that the fruits on here have been at this size, really the size of about a, a chickpea, for quite some time. I'm not really uh, too happy about it because to me this doesn't sound good. This really doesn't, uh, this isn't really a good sign in my mind. I know last year they did a similar thing, and shortly after this period I think they'll either drop off or they'll hang on and start swelling uh, to a larger size and maybe even start getting soft. You know, these are supposed to be about this size, about the size of a quarter or larger. So we still have a little bit longer to go. I mean, at least that's what it seems like. But I've, I know a lot of people that struggle to get their che fruits or chi fruits past this point. So I think if we get past this point, it's a really good sign. If we don't, it's a bad sign and I may actually consider putting this tree in the ground or completely ditching it uh, entirely. So anyway, everyone, this was Ross and this was my Che tree. We'll give you guys an update when this thing um, decides to do whatever it is it wants to do. All right. Take care, guys.